Hello everyone, welcome to back my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. 90 Day Fiancé star Nicole Nassiger has missled fans into thinking she's died more than a handful of times this year. Nicole was a single mom to a toddler when she matched with Moroccan man Azan Tafau online. She flew to meet him, but it was obvious that Azan wasn't impressed with Nicole. Azan asked Nicole to lose weight. He refused to show any kind of intimacy towards her while she was madly in love. However, Nicole and Azan were engaged and managed to get cast in multiple seasons of In the 90 DF franchise following their original season 4 stint. Nicole and Azan had planned to get married three different times, but in the end, following months of rumors, she finally announced their breakup. Nicole assured fans she was starting college. She became a Twitch streamer to make money. Someone spotted her working at a Starbucks. Nicole posted sweet updates with her daughter, May, on social media. However, she had also started sharing links to clickbait articles that claimed she had either died or was pregnant with twins or made it look like some other 90 Day K cast member had passed away, including Azan or her own daughter. Nicole had taken a break from sharing these clickbait articles on her Instagram for quite some time, but she started again when her namesake, Nicole Sherbany, first appeared in 90 Day Fiancé, Happily Ever After, Season 8. Nicole or whoever advises her to post about the fake articles may have thought that fans would end up on Nicole's IG page somehow while being curious about Mamund El Sherbany's wife, and that would add to the number of clicks she usually gets on her fake links. Nicole posted her first fake death story in April 2024. It was a zoomed-in photo of Nicole's face taken from a still from one of her 90 Day Fiancé episodes. A black and white filter was added to the photo to make it look more morose. The caption was eerie. It said, Hashtag RIP devastated to confirm S-H-E-A-K-S-D-I-H-D. It looked like Nicole had passed away and someone from her family was posting on her behalf. However, it was just Nicole playing with the minds and emotions of her fans to make a quick buck. Her post was like a prank making fun of gullible followers. Nicole's not only taking advantage of her followers, but she's also making money each time someone clicks on the link in bio to find out if she is alright. If anyone does want to ask Nicole what the matter is, they can't, since these posts always have the comments turned off. Like clockwork, they disappear from her page after 24 hours. Fans are left with no option but to dig out Nicole's last IG post on her feed from August 2023 to shame her and call her out. It even looks like Nicole no longer has control over her profile. Nicole has built her Instagram following of over 625k followers because she was on 90 Day Fiancé. If she hadn't been on the show, she wouldn't have had so many people following her to keep up with her life behind the scenes. Now, Nicole is using the same followers to earn an income. She is answerable to each one of her fans for her irresponsible behavior. She needs to share a statement telling them that she's safe and sound, and that the posts about her being dead were posted by her to earn some money on the side.